Hey everyone, it's Tony George, DocSports.com. Uh, free NBA basketball play here coming your way. Got one winner for you last night. Boy, Phoenix blew them out of the, just off the floor. Clay Thompson flipped out, got ejected from the game. Whew, sore losers. Uh, Suns put it to them. We got the winner on the premium side as well. We have a six-unit top play today in the NBA. My first top pick of the season right over there at DocSports.com. You can get it for free if you've never been a member. Just click the link in the description below. Take advantage of that free 60 bucks and pick up the card, and uh, it's on the house. And you still got money left over in your account. Do any better than that. Um, very quickly today, two things. Uh, week 8 NFL opening line report was not on YouTube. I taped that with Doug Upstone yesterday on the Vegas Beat, my podcast, and that's over at Twitter, at T. George Sports. Just on my profile page, you can see it there, archived there. And if you're not a Twitter guy or gal, it's over on Facebook as well. Just type in Tony George Sports. I've got a group page over there. So if you want to see and there was a lot of free leans and stuff. Doug was throwing out some picks, uh, early leans anyway, something for you to consider. Check that out. And also today... How about six free plays, three in college and three in, and three in the NFL? I go over to Red Rock Sportsbook, station, uh, Stations Casino spot over uh, here. We're out in Summerlin. Uh, very nice sportsbook uh, with Scott Spritzer. And we're doing the uh, Doc's Gridiron Six Pack. So be sure and tune into that on this YouTube channel. See, we're taping that at one. So I'd say it'd probably be up um, 530, 5 to 6 Central right here on this YouTube channel. So be sure and tune into that. Check out the line report over at Twitter at D George Sports. And of course, uh, the big play over at Docs tonight. In the NBA, plan on winning that one. Hello. Um, let's go ahead and talk about uh, some NBA. Um, Cleveland taking on Orlando. Orlando's picking up where they left off last year, being one of the worst teams in the NBA. This line opened up at nine. It's dropped down to eight and a half. Why? I have no idea. Uh, you take a look at Cleveland. This is going to be a contender in the East. Remember Donovan Mitchell over at uh, Utah? How big of a study he was? Well, now he's a stud at Cleveland. 33 points a game, seven assists, and five boards so far. Wow. And don't forget, you got Levert and Mosley at, at forward. Jared Allen in the middle, He's he got 17 boards his last game. Oh, by the way, Orlando center's out. You know, Suggs is out, and of course, Wagner's out for them. They just got stomped on their last road game. You know, I don't like laying eight and a half in the NBA, but this is a playoff team against one of the worst teams there is right now, and they're shorthanded, and they're not playing well. You know, the line dropped a half a point. You know, you could play the halftime line too probably if you wanted to and cut it basically probably about minus five for a halftime line. But I think they'd pull away and they put them away. Uh, you just got scores all over the floor for Cleveland. Cleveland's no easy out for anybody, especially with Mitchell running around. When he wants to go off, he'll go. He's got like, he's a lot like Damian Lillard. Just if he decides to go off, it's on. And I just like, I like this team. Levert, Mo, both of them, good forward, good good power forwards. Got a great guard running around. I mean, solid solid down low guy that can grab boards left and right, play defense. You're talking about, and I had a number here I wanted to pull up for you here to kind of support my cause here, and you just basically have a mismatch in this game here. Uh, you know, from a ranking standpoint, you know, and that's something I don't take lightly. But I was looking at this. You've got the number two defense in the NBA with the Cleveland Cavaliers. Going up against a 26th rated offense. And they're at home. On a strong home floor. Fans are going nuts for this new lineup up there in Cleveland. Give me the Cavs minus the eight and a half tonight for your free pick. Let's get another free pick winner. Uh, don't forget Doc Sports, free 60 bucks. I mentioned it, six unit, game of the week, top play. First top play of the season in the NBA. Come on. We're on a four and one run there. Let's get another one. Start stacking cash. 
uh, World Series lines are out. Pitchers haven't been uh, determined yet, and still they got Houston about a 165 favorite. So, that'll be out Friday. We'll take a look at that. You know, if it's too chalky and I like Houston, I'm not going to take it, obviously. You know, I like Houston to win the World Series. I can tell you that. Possibly in five. Um, NHL had a split yesterday. Lost one unit in the NHL. We got a three-unit totals play tonight. Uh, we got a three-unit NBA player prop tonight. And we also will have all football out tomorrow. Substantial move. And don't shy away from the NFL this weekend. Although I'm off a tough Sunday, you know, I'm totally transparent. You know, a lot of guys had a tough Sunday. It's not an excuse. I don't care what anybody else is doing, but I wasn't alone. You know, Survivor Pools got crushed. Teaser guys got, everybody got, it just was one of those Sundays. But I'll tell you what, we were on an 11-4 run before then, and we're coming right back. Uh, we're going to have a very strong play in the NFL and potentially a college football game of the year. Definitely going to be a seven unit. So look forward. And we're six and one the last uh, two Sunday, Saturdays in college football. So a lot to be excited for. Uh, be sure and stay tuned. Thanks for tuning in.